सो हेलो नमस्कार टू द ऑल के केमिस्ट्री लवर डॉक्टर से इंजीनियर्स ऑफ द नियर फ्यूचर मैं विजय कुमार सोनी आपका हार्दिक स्वागत करता हूँ इन केमिस्ट्री वाला चैनल रिगार्डिंग टू योर फॉर एन ऑल केमिस्ट्री इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द जस्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ द वन ऑफ द क्वालिगेटिव प्रॉपर्टी दैट इज नॉन एज जस्ट रिलेटिव लॉगरिंग ऑफ वेपर प्रेशर टूडे इज द टाइम टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सेकेंड क्वालिगेटिव प्रॉपर्टी एज अ वी हैव प्रोमिस रिगार्डिंग टू द सिलेबस दैट इज द एलोवेशन ऑफ बॉइलिंग पॉइंट so we go with the elevation of boiling point as a second property as a colligative property elevation of boiling point elevation of boiling point if we go with this property then it is denoted by delta tv first of all we'll go with the meaning of boiling point then temperature temperature when vapor pressure vapor pressure vapor pressure of a liquid or solvent becomes equal with equal with atmospheric atmospheric pressure called as your boiling point boiling point or it is also called as boiling point of boiling point of pure solvent boiling point of pure solvent it is denoted by it is denoted by t not this was about the definition of boiling point and uh, according to low standard we can say the temperature when a liquid started to boil when a liquid started to change in a vapor that is called as boiling point but the standard definition is whenever the vapor pressure of the liquid becomes equal with that atmospheric pressure so if we go with the just a graphical representation this is the graph and uh, this is the atmospheric pressure this is the atmospheric pressure this is the vapor pressure this is the temperature temperature so this is the pure solvent and it becomes equal with the atmospheric pressure at this temperature this is the atmospheric pressure this becomes equal that's why this temperature is called as just t not this is the boiling point of pure solvent t not now on dissolving this is the on dissolving on dissolving non volatile non volatile solute in it कल भी डिस्कस किया था हमने नेक्स्ट प्रीवियस वीडियो में कि जैसे नॉन वोल्टाइज सोल्यूट ऐड करते तो वेपर प्रेशर में डिक्रीज जाएगा सो इट विल डिक्रीज इन वेपर प्रेशर वेपर प्रेशर ऑफ सॉल्यूशन क्योंकि अब सॉल्यूशन का फॉर्मेशन हो चुका है सो so, जब वेपर प्रेशर लो हो जाएगा तो उसका ग्राफिकल रिप्रेजेंटेशन कुछ इस टाइप से हो जाएगा उस वेपर प्रेशर को हमें एटमोस्फेयर प्रेशर के इक्वल करना है तो उसको और टेम्परेचर देंगे बॉयल करने के लिए और टेम्परेचर देंगे यहां जाकर के पर्टिकुलर बॉयल होगा सो ऑन प्लॉटिंग ग्राफ जस्ट दिस इज द टी एस बॉइलिंग पॉइंट ऑफ सोल्यूशन एंड दिस डिफरेंस 
is called as just your this is the difference it is denoted by t s minus t naught this will be del t b elevation of boiling point this is for the solvent this is for the solvent and this is for the solution this is for the solution solution so these are the two graphs so what we'll say so to make equal to make equal to make equal with atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure it will require it will require large amount of large amount of temperature large amount of temperature you can see ts is greater than t naught it is denoted by it is denoted by ts that is called as boiling point of solution so what we can say that just solution boils at high temperature at high temperature then the pure solvent pure solvent ki compare mein solution high temperature pe boil hoga so you can say ts is greater than t naught and this increase in temperature is called as elevation of boiling point it will be ts minus t naught elevation of boiling point boiling point this was about the just boiling point and elevation of boiling point now the time to discuss about the round flow according to round flow it's a colligative property so del t b is directly proportional to the molality so del t b is equals to k b molality is denoted by m and this is the first form first formula is ke upar particular numerical aap se pucha jata hai what is the meaning of kb this is the kb is your molal elevation constant molal elevation constant particular unit ki baat kare to the unit for the molal elevation constant it is also called as ebullio ebullioscopic constant jiske liye unit hogi aapke paas kelvin kilogram mole inverse aur agar aapko uski definition nikalni hai then you can say if molality is equals to 1 then del t b will equal to the yeah you can say just kb will equal to the del t b means molar elevation constant or ebullioscopic constant will equal to the elevation of boiling point when the molality of solution is 1 this is the definition of ebullioscopic constant again i am repeating just you can say ebullioscopic constant or ele molar elevation constant is equal to the just elevation of boiling point when the molality of solution is 1 or unity now the time to discuss about the formula kb can be calculated by m r t not square upon delta h vaporization in 2000 where kb aapko malum hai molar elevation constant 
n is the molar mass of molar mass of solvent molar mass of solvent r is the gas constant 8.314 joule kelvin inverse mole inverse and t not is the boiling point of boiling point of pure solvent pure solvent and uh, enthalpy of vaporization del h vaporization means enthalpy of vaporization this key value particular yeah t not ki value aap log find out kar sakte hain t not can be calculated by the just there are two method so one of the method is land burger method land burger method ke through particular t not ki value ko find out kar lenge hum log this was about the just uh, molar elevation constant or heliotropic constant now we try to discuss about the molarity so equation first is your del t b equals to k b this is the moles of solute upon mass of solvent in kg we'll go with the further this is regarding to this formula with the entire matter properly because of it is too important so if we go with the further regarding to elevation of boiling point and this is the one of the important question how you can define the value of t not then you will say by using land burger method we can define the value of t not this is the land burgers method it's a very important competition exam mein puchha jata hai now the time to discuss about the the moles so the formula is del t b is equals to this is the k b moles ko find out karne ke liye hum log keh sakte hain mass of solute that is also called as given mass upon this is the molar mass of solute molar mass of solute and this is your mass of solvent mass of solvent in kg isko gram mein convert karna to upar 1000 se multiply kar denge this is the second formula now we'll assume about the mass of solute and molar mass so you will say if small w gram solute having molar mass small m dissolved in capital w gram of solvent then equation second will be del t b is equals to this is the k b into small w in gram upon molar mass small m mass of solvent capital w in gram and whenever we are going to take this gram then it will use of 1000 over here so this is the elevation of boiling point this is the equation number that is the third so this is called as elevation of boiling point if we we'll go with the important formula then this is the one of the important formula 
number one this is the number two now i would like to go with the molar mass of solute similar to first property this is the molar mass of solute from equation third from equation third what may this is the small m so m is equals to this will be your kb into small w in gram into thousand upon this is the del tb into capital w in gram this is the equation number fourth and it will numerical over this formula so this is the important formula now if you want to change the value then del tb is equals to ts minus t naught so this formula may be as follows also m is equals to kb into small w in gram that is the thousand upon del tb is your ts minus t naught ts minus t naught and this is the capital w in gram this is the equation number fifth and as a final formula so if we'll go with the important formula regarding to numerical then this is the fourth third formula and this is the fourth formula and this was about the the second colligative property as a elevation of boiling point derivation is important for the rbsc for hindi medium and english medium and it will be numerical for the cbsc first formula second formula third formula and fourth formula and numerical will be direct value based and you have to learn about the just value of kb its unit and uh, another name of the kb that is the ebullioscopic constant and t not can be defined by using landberger's method this was about the just elevation of the boiling point now the time to discuss about the third important colligative property that is the depression of freezing point or depression in freezing point you can say anything so this is the third property as a depression of freezing point depression of freezing point it is denoted by delta tf what is the meaning of freezing point first of all we have to decide just temperature when vapor pressure of a liquid of a liquid or you can say pure solvent becomes equal or in equilibrium equal or equilibrium for solid and liquid state that temperature is called as your freezing point freezing point and we are using here solvent so it is denoted by t not this was about the definition of freezing point if will dissolve on dissolving non volatile solute in it 
then it will decrease in vapor pressure vapor pressure will decrease hoga. graph is as follows this is the graph and uh, this is the pressure when both solid and liquid state are in equilibrium it is denoted by TS your P naught for the solvent this is the temperature and this is the vapor pressure this is for the solid solvent this is the liquid solvent as we know that vapor pressure for the liquid will be higher liquid solvent whenever will dissolve non volatile solute in it then vapor pressure decreases and it becomes by decreasing over here this is the P naught this is the PS vapor pressure of solution this is T naught and this is the TS you can see here T naught is larger than the TS means solution freezes at low temperature so this is this difference is del Tf that is equals to T naught minus TS so what will say here is the on dissolving non volatile solute in it it will decrease in vapor pressure so solution will freezes freezes at low temperature low temperature it is denoted by freezing point of the solution it is denoted by denoted by TS so TS you can say T naught is greater than TS and this decrease in freezing point is called as del TF this is the T naught minus TS this was about the freezing point and in solution just in a boiling point we have discussed TS is greater than the T naught now just according to according to Raoult flow for non volatile solute we can say this is the del Tf is proportional to again molality so del Tf is equals to Kf into molality equation number 1 this is the numerical formula where again Kf is equals to molal freezing constant or you can call it cryoscopic constant cryoscopic constant if we we'll go with the just definition of the cryoscopic constant then we can take if molality is 1 then Kf will equals to del Tf means cryoscopic constant or just molal freezing constant will equal to the just depression in freezing point when the molality of solution is 1 this is the definition a unit is your same Kelvin kilogram mole inverse and the value can be calculated by Kf is equal to it was MR T naught square upon del H fusion in 2000 if we we'll go with the just uh, values this is the M molar mass of solvent molar mass of solvent this is the R is a gas constant 8.314 joule Kelvin inverse mole inverse 
unit for the gas constant T naught is the just boiling point of pure solvent it can be determined by using Batman method by using Beckman method and uh, del H fusion is your enthalpy of fusion enthalpy of fusion this was regarding to this now from equation first from equation first what is that del T F is equals to K F into moles of solute upon mass of solvent in kg this is the del T F is equals to K F moles can be determined as follows mass of solute that will be in gram given mass upon molar mass of solute and uh, molar mass of solute into mass of solvent in kg whenever it will be in gram it will be multiplied by the thousand we can say this is the equation number second if small w gram solute having molar mass small m dissolved in capital W gram of solvent then equation second will be del T F is equals to K F into small w in gram this is the thousand upon because mass of solvent taken in the gram and this is the molar mass is small m this is the capital W in gram this is the depression of freezing point equation number third depression of freezing point this was about the just a depression of freezing point if we'll go with the important formula then this is the first important formula this is the second important formula now we'll go with the just calculation of the molar mass read the entire matter properly So, if we we'll go with the further formula, then these are the two important formulae. What are they? Listen me carefully. This graph is also important. So, molar mass of solute. This is the molar mass of solute. From equation, from equation, that is the third. Just m is equals to. This is the K F into small w in gram into thousand upon del T F into. This is the capital W. In gram, and this is equation number your. You can say fourth for the calculation of molar mass, or you can say del T F is equals to T naught minus T S. So small m is equals to K F is equals to another formula small W in gram because solution freezes at low temperature into thousand. This is upon T 
T naught minus T S and this is capital W in gram. This is equation number fifth regarding to numerical. These are the two important formulae. This is the number one and this is the number two, number three and number four important formulae. I am going to just enclose by the bracket or just box. This is also important. And these are two important formulae. And this was about the just depression of freezing point. So, dear student, this was about the three important colligative properties as are just uh, uh, relative lowering of vapor pressure and elevation of boiling point and depression of freezing point. We will meet in the next video with the just. Uh, Another fourth important colligative property that is called as osmotic pressure, osmosis, type of the osmosis and just mathematical derivation of the osmotic pressure. Till then, shukriya, dhanivad, we will meet in the next video. You have to subscription, sharing, continue to keep because your support is requirement for me and I will provide maximum to maximum content to you. Next video, shukriya, dhanivad.